When you have finished recording, you may hang up or press one for more options. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm, I'll, I should hear you call back here. I, I'll try your number. You try this one, and hopefully we can connect. I don't know. Hello, welcome to Here's the Pitch, and that tease is uh, definitely Artie Lang. That was not Artie Lang. That was Sour Shoes. Hello, and welcome to Here's the Pitch. I'm your friend, Brad. And, of course, this is sponsored by Masses Restaurants in St. Louis, five locations, stlmasses.com. So uh, I am updating this piece of uh, video because um, you may have heard on the Stern Show just recently their uh, issues getting a hold of Sour Shoes. And, of course, that was Sour Shoes and the T's calling me as Artie Lang. So I was on the hunt for the Sour Shoes interview myself and uh, thought we were there. And I'm going to tell a little story about it here. And you'll get to hear some of the voicemails he left me. But we were on our way. I, th I thought I was going to be talking to the great Sour Shoes, and I was very excited about it. Uh, but after I heard what uh, happened to, I think it's Derek. Is there a Derek on the Stern Show? I, again, I'm not sure who that is. I don't list. I mean, I'm listening, but I don't know who these people are. They just sort of show up. But I uh, just want to mention a few things. Please subscribe, as always. More Stern content coming your way. More content all the time on this channel. I th can't thank enough folks who are doing super thanks. Uh, really appreciate it. Uh, melts my heart, makes my heart full. I can't believe there are people out there, but I am very appreciative of those folks. And I've now activated memberships. So I, I've noticed on YouTube, I'm saying, hey, if you've got folks that are interested in your show, which again, if I'm getting super thanks, there must be people interested in the show, you should start memberships. So I do have memberships enacted, and you can see those in my YouTube page. Uh, you have the Jackie plan, uh, the Artie plan, and the Beetle plan. And I'll tell you about the Beetle plan because it's the most expensive, but I think it's one maybe you might be interested in. So I'm offering uh, uh, folks who are f members uh, a chance to come join me on the show when I uh, have guests. You'll you'll get to know who's going to be on, and you can pop in and uh, ask some questions of those guests or just be part of it. That's the Beat membership. Uh, you can check out those memberships on my YouTube channel here on Here's the Pitch. You can just shoot, sh uh, search ST Weekly as well. But uh, once again, thank you for joining on here and uh, being a subscriber. Um, had a lot of subscribers over the past few years uh, due to the content I was putting out. You'll continue to see that along with newer stuff. Uh, just branching out and doing all kinds of things. So, Sour Shoes. I heard them talk about how they could not get hold of him. They try calling him, and I'm going to tell my story here. I, I found his phone number, got it, uh, I think, I got it from somebody, actually, now that I think about it. And I called, and I got a woman answer, and it was his mother, and his mother was delightful. And we had a 15 to 20 minute conversation, and I was just um, very excited to talk to Sour Shoes' mom. And we talked a little bit about um, what he does, um, why I'm a fan, what I do on my show, and uh, just excited to be able to talk to a person I think is incredibly talented. Um, probably my favorite part of the Stern Show right now. I don't know. Uh, I'm not a real big fan of Ronnie being on for, for two or three hours a day. Um, the, the impersonators don't really do anything, but Sour Shoes is one of those originals. And uh, so the fact that I was talking to his mother, and his mom said, hey, he'll be home around four. You should call back, and uh, we can set this up. So he was, I think, working with some kids down the street, and the kids, uh, I think, have Down syndrome, but they love Sour Shoes as well. Who wouldn't? So... Um, talked to him at dinner and he said, hey, I'm having dinner, can I call you back? And it was funny, I talked to Sour on the phone and I said, absolutely. And um, uh, he did not call back, so I tried again the later the next week and uh, the phone line was blocked as it was on the Stern Show. And it was uh, the woman saying, this person is no longer accepting calls. So I tried uh, for my wife's phone. I figured, well, let me try a diff different number and see what happens. Uh, I got voicemail. So I left a voicemail and uh, left you know, the same message I basically told his mother, hey, I talked to your mom and hopefully you're interested. And, and he was and um, but didn't get a call back. But I got a text from another number and um, it, was a <laughs> it was a voice memo. And it's what you heard uh, early on there at the beginning of this tease. And so we started having discussions about being uh, on the show. And we even talked about him just sending me um voice memos like that, I'll ask a question and he can just respond however he wants to respond. But I, you know, 
candidly wanted to have a straight interview with him. I want to, I want to know him. I want to know more about him. I've, I've seen the John Lieberman piece. Uh, it's really good if you haven't. Uh, if, by the way, I've talked to John Lieberman many times uh, via, via email. Uh, not wanting to be on the show, I totally understand now that he's back with the Stern Show. But, uh, uh, but John did an in-depth thing with him, which was great. But kind of the same thing. I wanted to do it in my style and get maybe some questions that I have, but also have some fun and have people come to this channel to see some updated Sour Shoes stuff. So anyway, I'm texting him and he's he's telling me that maybe we can just do it this way. Uh, maybe I'll just you you ask me a question and I'll I'm like yeah I can do that. Um, but was there a way? Do you have a, an email? I'll send you a link and we can kind of get this set up. And then it just went on and on and on. And I'm like, who maybe this won't ever happen. So I had to call from another number. Kept getting the number blocked as they were on the Stern Show. Same thing. Uh, but then he said, "Hey, I'm going to be in New York. I'm going to be at Sirius in March. Maybe uh, you can we can set it up when I'm there." And I thought, "Okay, great. That would be very weird if he's up at Sirius and we're doing this. I would have thought that's amazing." Um, but no, no response, no answers. But we still were texting. Uh, so I sort of just let it go. Fast forward to today, uh, when I heard the update um, last week on the show, I thought, "Oh, I should try calling him and texting him." So both numbers are no longer working. I am going to continue to work trying to get Sour Shoes on this show, but I wanted to give my experience of what happened. It's the same exact thing that happened to the Stern folks, so I I feel pretty good about it. Um, The man is is clearly uh, out there, Um, but I did put this out uh, a few months ago, and people seem to enjoy it, so I wanted to give an update. Uh, But I'm going to take you back to the show that I did, and uh, you'll get to hear Sour Shoes answering questions for me, at least, in uh, all of the voices, and it's uh, it's just wonderful. Again, I appreciate folks folks doing super thanks. I uh, really, really uh, encourage you to do that if you like the channel, you want to see more of this content. Uh, If you want to be a member, the memberships, I think, are going to be fun. I'm offering you a chance to be part of the show if you're uh, interested and uh, be part with the guests that come on here, so you'll, you'll be able to be right here on the show with me. Um, So we'll see how that goes, if it gets crazy. I'm also thinking about starting a store, a merch store. What do you think of that? Uh, I'm I'm actually uh, looking at all the options here on YouTube because uh, I've had a a wonderful success with uh, the the material I've been putting out here. I can't thank the folks enough who come here and watch it. Um, Sometimes I do have to repurpose some things and I appreciate folks just sort of seeing it. Some people have never seen it. Uh, And that's, if you really wanna know why, sometimes there's some older stuff. Some people haven't seen some of the older stuff and I like to just make sure everybody sees it. So with that all out of the way, I'm gonna go back to the uh, show that I did back in uh, whenever I did it and you'll get to see uh, Sour Shoes answering some of my uh, voicemails. So let's take a look. So I'm just gonna read the text that I sent to him uh, and and then you'll hear the uh, response from Sour Shoes. So that was, of course, the first one. It was him doing his wonderful Artie Lang impression, I think is is crazy. Give this number a try, sweetie. Sorry about all the problems with our phones. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm, I'll, I should hear you call back here because I'm gonna be. I'm, I'm eating uh, some gabagool, some sausage and peppers, and uh, some leftover uh, linguine with uh, meatballs, and uh, some pizza gain, and, and then I got like I got a little bit of uh, noodles with some stroganoff that uh, looks really delicious. So so let me know. Try I'll try I'll try your number. You try this one, and hopefully we can connect. I don't know. Uh, there's all kinds of problems with our trees and down wires where we are with all the different windstorms. That could be a problem. I don't know what the problem is, but uh, I'm going to keep calling your numbers and hopefully we can connect. All right. Oh, it's so awesome. I got Kaiser rolls, too. With a little bit of butter on it that I'm dipping in the, in the beef stroganoff and the gravy. It's so good. <laughs> Then I'm going to save two other rolls for bologna and cheese. I always like that. Where you, I mean, you can get bologna for, for $1.99 a pound. I mean, where are you going to get meat like that in this with this administration? And uh, and then the other, then I got a loaf of Italian. I'm going to save for the sausage and peppers and uh, the raviolis and the chicken parmesan and the shrimp scampi. And uh, <laughs> probably I'll save another half a roll for, uh, you know, it's so funny. You know how painters have like, coffee cans filled with thinner and water that they put their brushes in when they're done. Like all around my house, especially at my mom's when she's cooking, I have like coffee, I have like cans filled, olive oil cans filled with vinegar and oil and my utensils in them. <laughs> That's the only work I do every day. <laughs> but I love you. I'll talk to you in a little while. Just let me know if this connection's working for you. All right. Bye, Brad.
we're having so what we're having is phone issues I, I can't get a hold of him on the phone he can't get a hold of me on the phone so i said okay i tried to call you i'm not getting through what's your email address and what's a good time to set up a zoom video call this was his response yeah tell me about it i know you know Actually, I don't know. It's so weird. I don't know what it is. You know, it's interesting. It's interesting. You know, from home and from here at Direct Care, I can't get through with both numbers that I'm trying. Um, but to answer your question, real quick, real quick. Um, so I tried to go on and I didn't have any luck. But but to retrieve messages, but give that a try. Um, other than that, you could just, I guess, communicate through this track phone. Give it a try. Okay. I, I got to run. All right. So then uh, I, I told him I'm really enjoying the voicemails. I sent you an email. Uh, uh, do you do you or your family have an Apple phone or Facebook? Maybe we could try a video call that way. Here's the response to that. Um, I, here's the I think we did have something like that. Uh, but there was some password problems. The, some guys down at SiriusXM were running it, putting up audio. A lot of people had access to it. So... Uh, couldn't get on it, didn't really even try, so don't have any kind of ass book or anything like that, um, but what we could do is you could keep doing it this way, you feed the questions in, and then I come back with a retort, if you want to try that, or could, could it be a call in, could it be done over the phone, I don't know, you, uh, you let me know what you think, uh, how it would best work for you, sha 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 shake it up. So then I wrote back, okay, it's possible to try it this way. Um, hoping we can do a video interview. Can you send a video of your answers somehow? So I'm really trying, and here's his response to that. Oh, hello, hello. Sure. I could be the camera guy. Yeah, just just like Joey Boots does for me. Yeah, give me that shit. Yeah, like, I don't care. I'll hold the camera. I'll record you. I'll send you shorts. Whatever you, whatever you need. Hey, B. What's up? Yeah, who, me? Yeah, B. That, that's all right. I don't play that. I just, uh, you just call on the hot dog. That's all. Yeah. I'm gonna play that way. It's all good. I then said, all right, well, let's give this a few days and see if we can work our, get our phones to work. Um, and uh, this is his response on that. Right, right, right. Let's let it marinate. Let's let it marinate a little bit. And then we'll try it in a couple days. Sounds great. I gotta, re I, I gotta recharge this, so uh, I'll talk to you real soon. Love you. Bye. And then I responded, sounds good. Um, enjoying hearing you do your thing. What a super talent. And then he responded with this. So this is my hope in my next uh, interview for this uh, month. It's Sour Shoes. We're going to work on this. Uh, again, I'm really excited. <laughs> Hopefully you enjoy just the voicemails. I would be fine getting voicemails every day from Sour Shoes. Uh, again, I'm a huge fan. And uh, uh, hopefully you are too. And hopefully uh, we will connect and have a full length interview. But I did tease this. Hopefully uh, the folks that are coming to these are checking out. If you enjoy or want to know what's going on in the Stern Show, but you don't have Sirius, you want to see what you're missing, see what you're not missing, as I've been mentioning. Um, I'm hoping that uh, the show takes a turn and, and does a little bit better. I did notice that the pink interview actually was okay. But uh, I just, uh, not a huge fan of Pink, didn't really, wasn't interested, so I didn't listen to that interview. But uh, we'll continue to do daily recaps here or in the shorts. We'll continue to add shorts. Um, so you'll be here, uh, I'll be here, uh, Stern Talk Weekly, ST Weekly is your channel. Keep subscribing, I appreciate all the subscribers. Uh, do super thanks if you're enjoying that. Maybe I'll do a membership for folks and we'll do some special stuff. Um, but again, thank you for watching and uh, keep Keep an eye out on the channel as I hopefully will be posting an interview with Sour Shoes soon. You know, you know, it's so weird. It's so weird. Same thing happens here on my end. When I'm trying to call out, the same thing applies. Your party is not receiving calls at this time. It's so bizarre. It's so weird. I don't know if it's storm related. I don't know if it's the FBI uh, that got a lot of complaints about phone calls to the Senate building, to the Capitol Hill from here. And it's them, uh, you know, censoring phone calls out of this house or phone calls coming in. It's so weird. But anyway, uh, I'm I'm th I'm in our, in talks with uh, SiriusXM, um, and so there's there's a there's an I, there's a thought that we could probably maybe do it from the SiriusXM, SiriusXM studios, if you think that could work.